And just like that, the 45 minute mark has passed and we are now on the last, or hopefully the last episode of the recording session. You never know, sometimes recording sessions end up longer than that. Welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption. I am your host, Mega Shadow Fist, and uh, we're heading over to Santa. I'll help. Stop who? Hey! Hey! Don't run away. Where's the other person? Hey, you're not getting away from me, buddy. I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna... Yeah, you're on foot, buddy. You're not gonna get too far away from me. Where, where are you? I've actually gotten a lot better at shooting on horseback. I've noticed. Because, like, if you, seen, if you saw at the beginning of the game, I was doing terrible. Yay! I've done my good deed. I said that I was going to return back to being Ranger John, not just John Marston, and I did. I'm helping out people like I'm supposed to as Ranger John, the Avenger of the American Southwest slash Mexico. We all need help once in a while, friend. Yeah, got $4. Uh, and then this is probably where I'll put a text to let you know what that is in modern money. Probably, um, I don't know. I don't know how much $4 in 1911 money would be in, uh, the, in, uh, mo in modern money, but I will know by the end of the, by, while I'm recording, while I'm editing this, because I'll, you'll have seen the, uh, text effect that I'll put here, or, you know, not, it, it won't be here now, but it would have shown up. <laughs> anyway, um, excuse me. But yeah, like I, 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 I would love to have like uh, as it, I don't know. Did I touch on this at the beginning of this episode or the end of the last episode? Probably the end of last episode, um, which was just two minutes ago for me, but you know, two days for you because of how I have everything scheduled up and how I chop, I record in batches and everything. But um, I, yeah, it would be cool to have an office just to like to record like, the creatures do. Oh, obviously. Um, they record at the, I mean, they go to the office not just for recording. It's like, some people got like, they were just like, what? They were like, super confused. They were like, why are you recording in the office? You could just record at home. And, you know, I understand, <laughs> I understand that. It's like, I can understand why you're confused, but it's like, they didn't go to the office just to record. It was for more creature stuff. Um, I mean, I do have a mini fridge. But, as of now, the mini fridge in its entirety is rented out by my roommate. It's loaded with, like, I kid you not, kid you not, it's loaded with, like, six dozen packs of eggs. No, not six dozen packs of eggs, but six dozen eggs, so si six packs of eggs. And, like, the big thing of orange juice, like, there's literally no, like, I don't use a refrigerator at all, but if I wanted to use a refrigerator for any, anything, <laughs> I wouldn't be able to because it's loaded with fucking eggs and orange juice and shit. <laughs> I would love to have my own mini fridge. That was just like easy access so like if I were recording because like that's one thing that's like I wish that I had my own like apartment or something so I'd have like my own recording room and I'd have everything specially set up and everything make it easier to record I'd have like a refrigerator next to the desk so I could pull out emergency water sources because my water bottle is almost uh, empty. I like this water bottle though, it's really good. Um, I had to pay a lot for it. A lot more than what you what you would expect for a water bottle like this. I mean, it is insulated so the water stays cooler longer and I mean, so that's kind of cool but you're pay I, I bought it at the college bookstore because um, when I first got down here I would only drink two cups of water a day, literally. Like, I'd drink one during one meal and one during my second meal, and that was it. But then I was like, and then, like, if I got thirsty, I'd just go to, like, you know, a vending machine and start getting, like, you know, Dasani water bottles or maybe a Powerade. But then I was like, you know what? This is actually, it'd be, it'd be cheaper just to, like, pay whatever I have to pay for the water bottle and then, you know, have a refillable source. Probably one of the best investments I made <laughs> in college, actually. Nope, it's not the books. It's not the it's not the textbooks. It's a fucking water bottle. <laughs> what does that tell you about college in the United States of America? I know. So I was watching a video. Of this guy from Norway. He said that in uh, 
his uh he was talking about it and co it's free college well aside with the exception of living expenses of course uh college is free in uh Norway Your master. good news good news the coronel himself wants to speak to you come Can I shoot you right now, asshole? Or I'll kill her and all her family. They're probably rebels anyway, huh? Anyway, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill him. Good to see you. you know, you are a rare find. A gringo who is also a friend of our country. Bienvenido. We welcome you. Okay. Lad, relax, relax. I have some wonderful news for you. Quite wonderful, in fact. You know the men you hunt? They have been captured in Chupa Rosa. I want you and DeSanta to ride out there, and then you can take possession of them. It is my gift to you. <laughs> all your help, senor. Yay! Well, part of me wishes that you would remain here and enjoy more of our hospitality, huh? <laughs> hospitality. Thank you. If it's all the same, I'd like to collect the men. I have a wife and son at home whom I miss. Ah, don't we all, amigo? Don't we all? <laughs> what the hell? I want you to take care of Senor Marston. Vámonos, cabrón. Go. Adelante. Mi amor. Mi amor. God, I hate that guy. Follow me. A wagon has already been prepared. All right. I hate Coronel Allende, and I hate DeSanta, because San DeSanta's really- he's a fucking kiss-ass, and that's annoying. Um, and then, like, the leader of the rebels, I said I hated him too, so if I got a chance to kill him, that'd be awesome as well. But, uh, anyway. You know, one thing I'm actually nervous about is going to the rebel base and finding out that, like, they captured, like, uh, you know, um, Luisa or something like that, we have to, like, kill her or something. Oh, am I leading? Let's go! Buddies! Oh, am I supposed to accompany him in the carriage? That's probably what's going on. Oh, yeah, I guess I'm supposed to accompany him in the, in the, in the carriage. I don't know why I thought I was supposed to get on my horse. Okay, let's go! Weird jumping on animation. Skip to destination. Um, but, like, also, I wanted to touch on this. Um... From what I understand, apparently in uh, Canada, you can afford going to college or university, as it's called in other places, on a minimum wage, which is impossible in the United States because college is so friggin' expensive here for whatever reason. Overall, I'd say that my experience in college is starting to feel more like a scam than anything. I mean. <sighs> I'm just, yeah, <laughs> it's just, I don't even, I can't, can't even find the right words to explain, it's just, I just find college to be silly. I mean, like, I, I, I'm not explaining this properly. I'll wait for the cutscene to play out before I say what I need to say. It's not going to be Billy Williamson. Oh, in a, in a church. Oh, now they're gonna try to kill us. I knew that shit was gonna happen. What a- you know what? You, I swear to God, I'm going to kill every single one of you. <laughs> you have betrayed this land enough. I hope you have a clear conscience. Because you're about to meet God. <laughs> no, I'm not. Someone's going to save me in the last second. Yep, like that. My ah! It's a leader of the rebels who is an asshole, but he saves me, so that gives some brownie points for me. <laughs> Okay, can I break out of these like Bruce Wayne did at the beginning of uh, Batman Arkham City? I guess not. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have the roadie run. I said this isn't Gears of War. Ooh! Run, Ranger John! 
Disco Inferno. I don't know why I was singing. I don't know why I was singing it to that tune. Anyway, Ranger John, let's go! <laughs> I guess so, even though he is kind of an app. Oh, hell no. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. I want my fucking weapons back. This is my chance for revenge. I'm gonna kill every single one of these guys. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, now it's time to shoot all you stupid hat people. You guys aren't wearing sombreros, so now it's like all those times that like I made a mistake of killing you guys by accident, I regret not killing you guys because you're all assholes. We're gonna kill you? Okay, I'm gonna get some I'm gonna get some cover actually before I end up dying. I don't want that to happen. Oh there's someone shooting up up someone up someone up here. So remember how I said that like they did a good job of like not show it of like blurring the lines and show that neither the resistance nor the oh that those are good guys neither the resistance nor the uh nor the actual government were good guys like they were just like sort of middle uh now that i think about it i don't know if i'm just reevaluating my uh oh now i'm gonna die yep <laughs> i know that's gonna happen i don't know if i'm reevaluate reevaluating because the guy saved me but I'm starting to think that they made the uh, government seem a lot more worse off than the rebels. Because, like, the leader, <laughs> he's a bit, uh, I don't like him because, like, he, like, <sighs> I don't like him. I, I just don't. But he's not as much of an asshole as Allende or uh, DeSanta were. Uh, I kind of don't want to kill Cap. Is Captain Espinosa like the heavy set guy? I don't want to say the F word because I don't want to offend people who are. Oh, I'm gonna shut up now. But um, the bigger individual. Oh shit! 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 No! Oh, fuck! 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 Um. Um. Oh my God! No! Good God, I'm gonna die because I have terrible cover. The, if there was any time to use, uh, bullet, not bullet eye, but, uh, quick, quick draw McGraw, now is the time. Alright, now stick out your head, asshole. I know you're there. I guess he's not. Where's the last person? Where's the last person? There's another guy. There's another guy. Okay, so now I'm gonna need to kill uh, the captain. Cause that guy, he was actually pretty cool. He was all, he was on the bad side of uh, Allende de Santa also, but. Okay. Oh, Jesus! How did I survive that? <laughs> no freaking idea. But regardless, let's go. Oh no! Please don't kill me! Please don't kill me! Please don't kill me! Alright, now I'm gonna wait right here so that I can have my health regenerate. Okay, now we're good. The frame rate's a bit... was a bit wonky there for a second. But this game has really... Whoa! Wonky frame rate! Uh... Oh, it is... I actually like this guy. He wasn't that bad. But I have... I guess I have to kill him because he's part of the group. Tonight, we ride! That the days of this evil regime are numbered. Now can we kill DeSanta? We shall be free, living together in a noble republic, justly ruled by fine men. But, 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 el trabajo, the job is not done. Our struggle is not over. We will fight all day and night. Until local tyrants like Allende are no more. And him and all his dogs are brought to the sword. We shall be free. This time thing 
shall be different for every man and woman in this land. And, and one day, and one day soon, again they will know justice. My brothers, fight on! In our hearts, we are all free. Let us make it so. Viva la revolución! <clears throat> Sorry about that. It's too bad that John Marston doesn't give a shit about all this, because I would really love to kill uh, Allende and uh, DeSanta, because they are fucking a Oh, wait a minute. Let's go to the map. Looks like we have a, a Luisa and Landon Ricketts mission, I guess. There's Luisa. Oh, Abraham Reyes. Yeah. All right, so uh, we'll do those later because um, I want to wrap up the recording session. So let's go ahead and call. Oh, Kratos is right here already. Let us go, brother. You know, Kratos. Kratos. I I think uh, Poppycock quest failed. I know that I failed yeah. that. I'm pretty sure that. Uh, this horse, Kratos, will be better than Avenger Second Son because, you know, if you've ever played Tales of Symphonia, you know that Kratos has an X spear. So, yeah. I don't know why I tied that in. I just, I just felt like it was necessary to at least make one Tales of Symphonia reference. Well, um, because, I mean, the horse is named after the Tales of Symphonia. Well, it's named after. Yeah, it's named after. Uh, it's named after a <laughs> freaking. Uh, Tells the Symphonia character. Anyway, let's head back to the house of, uh, I was, I was about to say the House of Glory, but that doesn't make sense. I mean, I guess it could. Or could it? The world will never know. Regardless, I'm just going to go ahead and get to the house, uh, and up the edit tomorrow's video, which would be the first episode of the recording session, uh, and then have that soldier to go up tomorrow, and then I guess I'll call it a night from there. So, let's go ahead, actually I want to hitch up my horse, like the Green Day song, Hitching the Right. I don't know if, um, if like, anyway. Yeah, I don't know if like that low hum that I was just doing is going to like show up on the recording or if it's going to get edited out with all the uh, with all the uh, rest of the background noise, but whatever. If you like this video or this series of videos, please feel free to leave a like. If you thought it was cool, please feel free to subscribe. Also, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash MegaShadowFist. I'll be sure to, sure to leave that in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is MegaShadowFist signing out. Bye!